Okay. Now, I was reading a statistic that about 40% of women seeking midwifery care can't get it because of a shortage of midwives. Mm -hmm. um, is that true? And what's sort of being done to kind of help mm -hmm. prevent that or improve that? I don't have the exact statistic at my mm -hmm. finger, but I do know that a large number of women seeking midwives can't get those midwives. Part of it is in how midwives are trained. Part of our model is to have one-on-one -on -one preceptoring with the senior midwife. So as a midwife, I almost always have a student, but only one at a time. And so in any given year, you know, I could only help half a, a midwife, only get halfway towards um, her, her training. Um, so I think that's w one of the reasons is just how midwives are trained. Um, it's a slowly growing profession. It also has a fairly good rate of attrition of midwives losing, leaving the profession because of lifestyle concerns or of, um, you know, of just finding that it's a different job than they expected it to be. Um, it's going to change over time and midwives are an important part of filling the gap of obstetricians who are leaving the field, of family doctors who are no longer helping to birth babies, um, but it's not the only answer. We definitely need more midwives. I don't know, I, I don't know what the answer is to help bring more midwives on site and I think that women have to also organize themselves and to, and to write their members of provincial parliament and encourage you know, more midwives to be brought in. Part of it is you know, going to be a budget issue as years go on, but I think it will get easier for women to look after, to look for a midwife. Right now um, midwives deliver about 8% um, of the babies in the province.